fans, and welcome to TNA Explosion. JP, Jeremy Borash, along with Mike Tanay. Mike, hope you had a good Thanksgiving this last weekend. Tremendous, JB. How about yourself? Not too shabby, not too shabby at all. But I'll tell you what, it could be an even better couple of days coming up for AJ Styles. You see, it was AJ Styles who lost the NWA World Heavyweight title not too long ago against Jeff Jarrett. And Jeff Jarrett, since that time, has really lost his mind. He's lost his marbles. He's gone to Japan, taken out Hulk Hogan, only because he's paranoid. He went to John Boy and Billy, the most listened to radio talk show morning show in America, took out one of their co-hosts just because he said some things about Jeff Jarrett laying down for Hulk Hogan at Bash of the Beach. The man is simply paranoid, and he's out of his mind. Well, after what we saw this last Wednesday night, can Jeff Jarrett sustain the challenge of AJ Styles, who has been coming in with a lot of momentum? JB, you know, in an effort to avoid having to give AJ Styles the return match that he so richly deserves, Jeff Jarrett has been doing everything within his power to say that AJ Styles cannot compete at this level, at the level of the NWA World's Heavyweight title. But how about the performances of AJ Styles in recent weeks? A pin over the total package Lex Luger in a tag team match. A pin over Abyss on the TNA pay-per-view one week ago. And I think AJ Styles proved to the world, and he certainly proved to the NWA that he does deserve to compete at this level. And as a result, this Wednesday night, AJ Styles gets that return match. AJ Styles, Jeff Jarrett, and yes, the NWA World Heavyweight title belt of Jeff Jarrett will be on the line. Styles and Jarrett this Wednesday night. And Styles, Styles uh, has is, is been on a, a tear as of late, no doubt about it. But Jeff Jarrett has made the statement over and over again. He said, AJ, you cannot compete on my level. Well, what short memory the champion has. June 11th of this year, True. AJ Styles pinned Jeff Jarrett. AJ Styles became the world heavyweight champion. And this Wednesday night, on pay-per-view, can history repeat itself? Can the phenomenal AJ Styles, one of the most exciting, dynamic competitors to ever step foot in a professional wrestling ring, challenge the NWA world heavyweight champion, Jeff Jarrett? The only way to see this is by contacting your pay-per-view provider. you got to order TNA on pay-per-view this Wednesday night. Well, certainly we've been talking a lot about some of the interesting newcomers in total nonstop action. One who has hit the scene and has been on a rampage is a man simply known by one letter, X. Well, this last uh, Wednesday night, certainly we saw some interesting goings on with X. He's about to head to the ring right now on TNA Explosion. The opening contest for TNA Explosion is scheduled for one fall. How about to make his way to the ring from Essex, England? He weighs in. The Wonder Kid, Johnny Storr. The Wonder Kid is back on TNA's Explosion. One of the great stars from the UK, Frontier Wrestling in England, returns to Explosion. He weighs in at 260 pounds. This is X. What a dominant force that X has been in the X Division. And Don West, when we always talk about the X Division, being that grouping of wrestlers that has no limits, no weight limits, obviously X is taking advantage of that. I mean, this guy has to go well over 250 pounds. Well, it was an open invitation, Mike, for that for that tournament when he entered it. My gosh, like you said, he took it, takes it to another level, but you know, this guy can also move pretty good for a big man, but I'll tell you what, destruction is what X is all about. Yeah, we have seen him. Oh, well, just, look at it right there. Look at just exactly what you would expect from him. Taking Johnny Storm, who, let's face it, he outweighs Johnny Storm probably somewhere in the neighborhood of 70 pounds, I would think, something like that. I give Johnny Storm credit for even getting in the ring with X. I mean, this guy, I mean, he not, not only can beat you, he can physically harm you. Look but, at the agility, just so evident here from Johnny Storm. And Johnny Storm, I'm not sure if this is the right tack to take or not. Oh! Repeated like shots wall. before he was cut off by the man you see him making the symbol there, X. One thing X hasn't done, Mike, is make friends with these, these fans here on the asylum. They've seen him come in and destroy some people after matches. And, you know, it's not going to endear him to the fans, but I don't think he cares. Spiked him that time with the DDT, did X on Johnny Storm. He's got one mission, to destroy all that's in his path. And right now, that's Johnny Storm, and he's getting destroyed. Front suplex by X, hangs his opponent Johnny Storm out to dry across that 
the top rope across the top steel cable and then just flings him back into the ring. Yeah, total destruction in this matchup on the part of X, who has been an incredible force of the X Division. Missed the back elbow that time. Let's see if Johnny Storm can mount an off. Oh! Countered. Caught him in mid-move. Answered with the DDT, and Johnny Storm is going to go high risk. Well, you just wait against him, which is what you got to do with a monster like X. And there he does it again. And gets him out of the ring. Caught him with the Hurricane run off the top rope. Took X down. Is he going to fly again? Storm going to go slingshot. Oh, he just didn't have enough. Didn't have enough force there, Mike. He kind of came off that top rope. Didn't get enough height. And X just caught him like he was playing baseball. Johnny Storm trying to go slingshot into a cross body block. And you mentioned caught in midair by oh. X. Tossed him back in, but there's still fight left in Johnny Storm. Able to connect with the drop kick, sending X down to the floor. Well, Johnny Storm needs to do something here in Explosion. Of course, we've seen him on TNA many times. Oh! That's how you do it. You get the elevation up like that, Mike. You get a lot more G-force there when you come in like that. Double springboard into the flip, crashing down onto X. And opportunities there now for Johnny Storm. Let's see if he can take advantage of this. Momentum's on his side. Quick cover. Oh, boy. <laughs> he just threw him up. I think it's imperative for Johnny Storm to hook the leg when you go for the pin attempt here on X, especially when you have that kind of size, weight, power advantage. The ropes go Storm, boom, takes him up into the air and drives him down to the mat with impact. You can see how he's curling his back right there. You, you know, you get a spasm or something like that. I mean, it's just the force there that X, oh no. This could be dangerous. He's not going, yes he is, Mike. Oh! Catches him off the top. Diving headbutt, combination diving headbutt, part cannonball move off the top. You know, Johnny Storm looked like he barely just moved just enough to keep him from hitting him straight on, and that would have been the end of it, Mike. You know, this is the move that he has used to injure so many individuals. Oh! Stuffs him with it. The cradle pile driver, he calls it the execution, and it was for Johnny Storm. Dominant in the X Division, the mysterious mass man scores the victory appropriately enough on X Explosion. The winner of the match, the mass X. It's the best wrestling on pay per view today. TNA Total Nonstop Action Wrestling with Raven, AJ Styles, D'Lo Brown, Jeff Jarrett, and the man they call Sting. Plus the most extreme, high flying, death defying action anywhere with the X Division. There's nothing else like it today. TNA Total Nonstop Action Wrestling only on pay per view. The Wildcats and the Bulls battle on the border in the SEC Game of the Week today at 11.30 on UPN 30. Your home for SEC football action. In the huddle, on the sidelines, in the locker room, Titans All Access should be part of your weekly game plan when it comes to getting the behind-the-scenes information on your favorite team. Titans All Access brought to you by the brick industry. Real homes are made of brick. And by Nissan and your local Nissan dealers. Titans All Access, Saturday at 2.30 on UPN 30. We used to tell people we'd give them the three lowest quotes on their car insurance, and they'd actually believe us. Then somebody asked for a quote on direct insurance. I don't know what to say or what to do. I mean, nobody beats direct. That's right. No one can compete with direct. People all over Tennessee are saving money on their car insurance. Pick up the phone and call us now. And by the way, do you really believe you're getting three of the lowest quotes? Save a lot of money when you buy direct. They're here, two new sports and fitness facilities in Franklin and Harding Place. Introducing World Gym Sports and Fitness. Power pack to outperform all other clubs. More fitness choices, more exercise enjoyment, more for your fitness dollar. Call or stop by today for your free introductory membership. Remember the name, the all-new World Gym Sports and Fitness. Unbelievable and unsurpassed. Located in Franklin and Harding Place. World Gym, Nashville's best workout facilities. World Gym Sports and Fitness. This past Monday, the mouth of the South, Jimmy Hart, was a special guest on the nationally syndicated radio program, John Boy and Billy. And quite frankly, when Jeff Jarrett busted into the studio and the altercation that followed, when that took place, it was an embarrassment. Jeff Jarrett, you're the NWA World's Heavyweight Champion. Jeff Jarrett, you're a representative of the NWA and TNA. 
And Jeff Jarrett, you're supposed to be above that type of behavior. And quite frankly, what we witnessed this past Monday was an embarrassment. An embarrassment to the NWA. It was a black eye for TNA, and it was a black eye for the professional wrestling industry. And a manager of champions out of NWA TNA, Mr. Jimmy Hart, the mouth of the South End studio with us. Good morning, Jimmy. Good morning, guys. It's great being here today. Jeff Jarrett, uh, who is our big nemesis over at TNA, uh, he flew over to Japan. We were at the Tokyo. 55,000 people, a big press conference. He storms into the press conference, busts the uh, Hogan over the head with a guitar, and then return hurts his leg. So hopefully we'll get him up and running before long. Man, I'll tell you what, and Jarrett and Hulkster, now that you have a hope, I mean, they've had some history. This is the one title, the, the, the title that, that Jarrett now holds, the NWA title, is the one heavyweight title that uh, Hogan has never held. Uh, he, he, he had the WCW, uh, the AWA, uh, the WWF title, but he has never ever held the NWA title. One thing, Jimmy, I, I did want to ask you, we were talking about the Jeff Jarrett Hulk Hogan thing. The world title, why Jeff went out and laid down? Yes. He just laid down and let Hulk pin him like that. Why? That's that, what I said, why. You know, it's it's probably the, the biggest question that's going around the world of wrestling now. Here's Jeff Jarrett is, young superstar in the WCW at the particular time. Here we Jimmy Hart is going, I'm not going to sit out there in that damn lobby out there. And I'm, I'm supposed to be up next hour. You're going to come out here. And now, fellas, you sit down there and shut up. Uh, oh, no, Jimmy, no, no, Johnny, listen. This is, I ain't playing around. Jimmy, how many times have I told you not to bring that up, especially on air? I told you not to go there. That situation is still in a court of law. And you want to come in there and have fun and make jokes? You and Randy and Billy and Johnny want to cut up about this? Don't you do that ever again, Jimmy. Yeah, you want it, Jimmy. No, All due respect. Stop it, Jimmy. Fellas, you get your damn hands. Jimmy, 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 Jimmy listen. Listen, Jimmy, I'm sick and tired of you bringing that up time after time. Then you want to wear your little Y shirt out there. Pillars, get out of my way. I'm telling you right now. Like, oh, I'm oh, telling oh, you, oh, get out of my damn way. Hey, hey, hey. Man, listen. Hey, hey, hey. Well, uh, we were going to have uh, Jimmy in to talk about this uh, pay-per-view. Jeff Jarrett uh, comes in. I mean, we've known Jeff for a long time, and uh, we, we were talking about Hulk. I was asking about when he laid down for the, for the title, and obviously... Uh, he didn't take it real well. No, no. Uh, basically, he slapped the taste out of my mouth, and uh, I launched on him, and he put a wailing on me, but good. I, and I, and I, where this came from, I had no idea. I love Jeff Jarrett. I've known him for years, and he's a good friend. That may change today. I don't know. We've always had a relationship. Uh, he, you know, we here he listens to the to the show. Hey, he was part, listening pretty close but, this morning, isn't he? Yeah, like? uh, but uh, you know, now Eddie already heard President Clear Channel said uh, that's another in a long series of people who didn't take it yeah. real well. Today. So you know, sorry that yeah. it ends like that, but uh, yeah. we we're, we're not allowed to have Jeff back back in the studio or on the show. Yeah. You know, last week somebody asked me. They said, Jimmy. You've been all over the world. You've managed some of the biggest names in the history of professional wrestling. But what do you think about AJ Styles? And I said, you know what? He is the future in wrestling. The kid's young, he's quick, he's fast. He's got so much great athletic ability. But you know what he's got more than anybody else that I've seen over the last five or six years? He's got a heart. He wants this business. He wants wrestling. A lot of people have said he's too small, he's not quick enough. You know, it, it, but, but, but I don't believe that. Because you see, in my career, I've been with a lot of people that they said the same thing about, that was too small, that wasn't quick enough, didn't have the athletic ability, and they went on to be superstars in this great sport. And AJ is one of them. And you know what? I can't wait. I can't wait for the match between AJ Styles and Jeff Jarrett. I think he's going to prove to Jeff, just like he did Lex Luger, that he is meant to be in the ring with the biggest names in this business. And he will come out being a winner. I promise you that. This week, NWA World Heavyweight title match, AJ Styles and Jeff Jarrett. And I just want to impress upon you lads the importance of keeping the gold around Jeff Jarrett's waist. In fact, that's why we live. That's why we exist. 
That's why you guys get paychecks. That's right. Because we're here to protect the gold or we're all out of work. Do you understand what I'm yes, talking about? Going to die broken. Yes, I do. And Raven, if you come stick your nose out here, I'm going to knock that stupid look right off your face once and for all. I've lived in Nashville most of my life. And the longer I live here, the more I love it. It's rich with cultural diversity and filled with many amazing things to see and do, including major league sports. It's a place of great historical importance and deeply honored heritage. As a personal injury lawyer, I've had the privilege of representing people from all over Tennessee. My wife just out of the hospital and she's still in a lot of pain. And so many have invited me into their homes and shared with me their most difficult hours. Dad, Bart Durham's here. Thanks, Mr. Durham, for coming to my house to see me. My pleasure to be here. I think the people of Tennessee are the friendliest and most decent people in the world. And I'm so glad Nashville is my home. Justice is your right, and we demand it. Hi, Tony Lynn here to tell you about Option Rentals 23rd year celebration going on right now. Savings like complete bedroom suits with bedding for only $25 per week or living room groups with tables and lamps for only $25 per week. Need appliances or electronics? Look no further. Come join the celebration at any one of Option Rentals' three convenient locations. Tell them Tony Lynn sent you and receive your first week free. John Ritter and James Belushi are out to save the world. You missed you. If they don't drive each other crazy first, real men. Today at 3. There's one new television show that has it all. Intrigue, drama, and some of Hollywood's biggest stars. Except in this show, they're not acting. Celebrity Justice. The truth isn't scripted. Today at 5 on UPN 30. It's the best wrestling on pay-per-view today. TNA Total Nonstop Action Wrestling with Raven, AJ Scott, CeeLo Brown, Jeff Jarrett, and the man they call Sting. Plus the most extreme, high-flying, death-defying action anywhere with the X Division. There's nothing else like it today. TNA Total Nonstop Action Wrestling only on pay-per-view. Welcome back to TNA Explosion. JB, Jeremy Borash, along with the Professor Mike today, reminding you to log on to NWATNA.com. Not only can you read from the inside by JB, you can read Ask the Professor with Mike today, some backstage notes from Bob Ryder as well. All that and more on NWATNA.com. And Mike, I'm going to put you on the spot right now. What is the number one selling item on NWATNA.com? Take a guess. Well, I would presume it's not the Don West tank top. It is not the Don West tank top. Uh, let me see. And I would also presume it's not the Mike Tanay bobblehead. It is not the Mike Tanay bobblehead. Oh, that is selling well. I'm just going to take a stab in the dark here and say the three live crew t-shirt. Mike, they don't call you the professor for nothing. That's exactly Amazing. right. Three live crew t-shirts on NWATNA.com. Order yours now in time for Christmas. NWATNA.com. The three live crew t-shirt as well as t-shirts for Raven, AJ Styles, Jeff Jarrett. TNA, all that and more, NWATNA.com. Mike, this Wednesday night, back on pay-per-view. What a huge, epic battle it's going to be. I think this is going to be the third time each man has faced off one-on-one -on -one in the ring. Now, of course, when AJ Styles defeated Jeff Jarrett to become the NWA World Heavyweight Champion, it was a three-way with Raven involved as well. Well, this Wednesday night, it's Jeff Jarrett, it's AJ Styles, it's one-on-one, -on -one, and it's for the NWA World Heavyweight title. AJ Styles has pinned Jeff Jarrett's shoulders to the mat for the title once before. Can history repeat itself? Can he do it again this Wednesday night? You know, JB, I was just reflecting on some of the comments that we recently heard from the TNA management consultant, Don Callis. And it's pretty obvious to see what Don Callis is trying to do. His association with Jeff Jarrett, well, I think it not only protects his job position, but it also gives him the power, the clout that goes along with being associated with the NWA World's Heavyweight Champion. Will the landscape change this week, this Wednesday night on the TNA pay-per-view when Jeff Jarrett faces AJ Styles with that NWA World's title at stake? No doubt about it. Don Callis is a leech. He seems to go wherever the power is. Well, this Wednesday night, you're right. The very landscape of total nonstop action may change in one night. 
when AJ Styles challenges Jeff Jarrett for the NWA World Heavyweight Championship. Tonight, we've talked about it before on TNA Explosion. We've seen it over the last couple months with AJ Styles climbing that ladder, getting a shot this Wednesday night at the NWA World Heavyweight title. The momentum seems to be in his favor, no doubt about it. The paranoia seems to be in the corner of Jeff Jarrett. He's flown to Japan to take out Hulk Hogan. Took out one of the guys from the John Boy and Billy radio show. Just because he's paranoid. Absolutely. And his paranoia may be the very thing AJ Styles can capitalize on this Wednesday night to become the brand new NWA World Heavyweight Champion for a second time. Let's go to the ring for more action on Total Nonstop Action Explosion. The following match for TNA Explosion is scheduled for one fall, about to make their way to the ring. They are the team of Caprice Coleman and Roderick Strong. Caprice Coleman on the left side of your screen is a former wild side junior heavyweight champion as well as TV champion, trained in the Carolinas by the Hardy Brothers and his tag team partner. There you see Caprice Coleman. His tag team partner, there he is, Roderick Strong, who has been competing for the NWA Florida promotion in the Sunshine State. And their opponents making their way to the ring. They are the team of CM Punk and Julio Janeiro. When you talk about CM Punk and Julio De Niro, you cannot deny the incredible role that they've been on, Don. It seems like week after week, whether it's on Explosion, whether it's on the pay-per-view program, CM Punk and Julio De Niro have been forming quite a tag team and quite successful. You know, in this, in this, it's at different times right now for CM Punk and Julio, too. I think they're out there trying to find themselves, and they really have done it as a team. You know, Raven kind of let them know that, hey, he wants them to just kind of fly away on their own and go on their own, and they are, and they're doing a great job when they're together like this, and they really are a formidable tag team, and I look to see one day, maybe in the tag team title picture, if not tag team champs. And of course, that uh, devastating finishing move that they have, that uh, combination powerbomb neckbreaker, the near-death experience, it's one of the top finishing moves for all of the tag teams that have been competing in TNA. Very impressive. Oh, nice move there by Julio. Superior leg strength by Julio De Niro. Sends Roderick Strong face first through the middle turnbuckle. Flies across the ring. And Julio De Niro, using the size and weight advantage that he has, drives Strong into the corner before he turns things over to his partner, CM Punk, immediately in with oh, the echo of the knife edge chop to the chest. Oh, look at that agility right there. Set him up perfectly. Roderick Storm didn't even know, Strong didn't even know what hit him. And oh, see a Punk got the total advantage here, Mike. Connects to CM Storm, Russian leg sweep. Decides not to go for the pin attempt, and that uh, allowed Roderick Strong to rake the eyes of CM Punk and turn things over. Tag is in to the legal man, Caprice Coleman, who's immediately met with a drop toe hole. We can see right now the experience, though, that Punk and Julio have of working together now for so long. I mean, they've pretty much been a team going on, what, three months and, and counting, and it really is showing. Although right now, Caprice Coleman's got the advantage, and he gets the tag. Tag is in to his tag team partner, the NWA Florida X Division champion, Roderick Strong. Let's see if we're going to see any X Division-type moves here from Roderick Strong. I understand that he primarily had been a tag team wrestler until the past year or so. Oh, and nice kick. Graduating to the X Division, connects with the drop kick, the quick follow, and barely able to get a one count on CM Punk. CM Punk right now just looks lost. I mean, he, was, he had the advantage. He was just totally dominating out there. Now, all of a sudden, Coleman and Strong have taken total control, and there goes Coleman. Hit it perfectly, Mike. Great double team move by Coleman and Strong, and Caprice Coleman goes for the cover, and an ear fall here for this tag team on CM Punk and Julio De Niro. Punk's got to get the tag in here. If he doesn't, this is going to be over quickly. Oh, look at the, the agility there of Coleman. Series of kicks by Coleman going to lead to another pin attempt. Lateral press got the two count. Julio was there to make sure that CM Punk did not take the three count. Into the corner, tag is in. Coleman makes the legal man, Roderick Strong, but not before Coleman tattoos CM Punk. Great teamwork several for right hands. by Strong and Coleman. We Great really are, especially as you mentioned, against the team in CM Punk and Julio De Niro that have been together for several months. I just going to show you, Mike, if you can get the numbers advantage, it really doesn't matter who you're facing in a tag team match. If you can keep the numbers advantage out there, you can really do some damage. Oh, Punko has got 
Got the momentum turned. Despite the two on one odds, CM Punk is going to try to turn this match around. Imperative for him to get the tag in to his partner Julio De Niro, and there it is. Tag is in with oh, fire. Man. With a vengeance, Mike. Look at this. The Priest Coleman able to duck that big right hand the third oh. time. Catches Julio with a boot to the midsection before he's reversed. Oh, right into it. Face planted him. And just as he goes for the cover, does Julio De Niro, you see that Strong is there to make the save for his team. To the corner goes Julio. Oh. Great leg lariat out of the corner. Gonna go top rope. High oh, wrench. hit it perfectly, here it is! Moonsault leads to a two count before Caprice Coleman is able to break it up with a drop kick. Great alertness there by Coleman, just realizing it was almost over. Now he's got the advantage. He's coming in with a boxing style move right there. Daryl says, don't get too fancy with me. Maybe went to the Ali shuffle just a little bit too early that time. I'd say so, and here it comes. Yeah, we talked about this move. Oh! oh caught him that time. Man! Drives the elbow down across the chest, and that time able to kick out is Coleman. A little variation that time with De Niro going high risk. And now Julio and Caprice Coleman. Now ah, here they set it up. Him over. You ready for the near-death experience? Oh, he hit it perfectly! Combination, power bomb, neck breaker, leads to a win. The team of CM Punk and Julio Gennaro. A very impressive tag team in TNA. They use their finishing move, the near-death experience, to gain the win. They are that man, CM Punk and Julio Gennaro. It's the best wrestling on pay-per-view today. TNA, total non-stop action wrestling with Raven, AJ Styles, D'Lo Brown, Jeff Jarrett, and the man they call Sting. Plus the most extreme, high-flying, death-defying action anywhere with the X Division. There's nothing else like it today. TNA, total non-stop action wrestling, only on pay-per-view. Savage. On Big Three Records. Because Hulk Hogan is a real big punk. MichaelMann.com on your CD-ROM. Ooh, yeah. Available at Kmart and Kmart.com. Hi, I'm Albert Hainsworth, Pro Defensive Tackle, here to tell you that Freedom Communication USA now has four great plans to choose from. Starting as low as $29.95, or check out the Total Freedom Calling Plan for $59.95, which includes unlimited local and long-distance service and all your favorite line features. Albert Hainsworth and Freedom Communication USA tackling the high cost of home phone service. Call 1-877-739-9900. Sign up today and receive a free cordless phone with caller ID. Introducing Cheryl. Education is very important to me. This working mom is ready to unearth cool new video clues for Jeopardy. Come on with us. Meet the new Jeopardy Clue Crew. Tonight at 6 on UPN 30. Every time they get a call. Sounds like several people have been shot. They've got to be asking themselves, am I going home tonight? We've got an officer down behind Circus Circus. On Cops. Tonight at 6.30. It's the best wrestling on pay-per-view today. TNA, total non-stop action wrestling with Raven, AJ Styles, D'Lo Brown, Jeff Jarrett, and the man they call Sting. Plus the most extreme, high-flying, death-defying action anywhere with the X Division. There's nothing else like it today. TNA, total non-stop action wrestling only on pay-per-view. You know, every time you see me, I seem to have my hunting gear on. You know what I'm talking about? Well, the hunt's on. And coming up in the asylum, A.J. Styles gets an opportunity once again to prove that he is the caliber to be the NWA World's Heavyweight title right here on TNA on Wednesday night. Pay-per-view, if you will. When I think about being in the ring with A.J. Styles, it took me back a lot of years. It took me back in a time to where I was young, and I was uh, said to be, oh, I was too fat. I was too ugly. I had the fans behind me, but could I be the caliber that could be a National Wrestling Alliance World Heavyweight Champion? Proved them wrong on many occasions. Three times I wore that hard way. And 
Jeff Jerry, let me tell you something. Don't take AJ Styles lightly. And AJ Styles just do what you do so well. Because there's a big difference, as I said last week in one of my many interviews. And that was they are legends, they are icons, and then there's national treasure. A force of nature, if you will. And AJ Styles wants to be that real bad. Come on Wednesday night. It's the biggest event so far in the history of NWA TNA. Everybody gonna be watching. And Jeff, make one, no mistake about it. I'm gonna be watching too. Well, always good to hear from the American dream, Dusty Rhodes. And you can bet he's gonna be watching. I'm gonna be watching, you're gonna be watching. Eric Watts, the director of authority, is going to be watching, and the world is going to be watching this Wednesday night when A.J. Styles steps foot in the ring, gets his long-awaited rematch against Jeff Jarrett. You know, Jeff Jarrett held that NWA World Heavyweight title, actually won it for the first time just over a year ago, November 20th, 2002. Well, A.J. Styles came along and was the only one, has been the only one to knock off Jeff Jarrett. He needed that in June. Lost the belt again in October. Now Jeff Jarrett once again stands on top of the mountain as the NWA World Heavyweight Champion. And I have to be honest with you, Jeff Jarrett has turned into a paranoid maniac. AJ Styles still remains one of the most exciting, death-defying, phenomenal athletes to ever step foot in the ring. Well, these two paths will cross this Wednesday night. Once again, what a history between these two. And it will come to a head this Wednesday exclusively on pay-per-view for the NWA World Heavyweight title. For all the marbles, it's going to be Styles and Jarrett this Wednesday night. And, J.B., what a slap in the face it was to A.J. Styles when Jeff Jarrett said, Styles, you cannot compete at this championship level. I mean, think back through the history of TNA. Who's the one wrestler? Who's the only wrestler that has been X Division champion, World Tag Team champion of the NWA, and NWA World's Heavyweight champion? And that answer, the phenomenal A.J. Styles. And if that's not enough to prove that he can compete at this level, how about the pinfall win over Lex Luger in the tag match? The pinfall win over the 6'8", 300-pound monster abyss. AJ Styles has the chance to prove that, yes, he can compete at this level, and, yes, he can regain the NWA World's Heavyweight Championship belt when Styles faces Jarrett this Wednesday night on the pay-per-view. And you talked about all the interested observers, and I think you even mentioned him, the NWA Director of Authority, Eric Watts. He's obviously going to be very concerned about Styles and Jarrett for the NWA title. And recently, Eric Watts has been aligned with a person that I call the black shirt security equalizer, Heavy D Don Harris. Let's go to the action featuring Don Harris this week on Explosion. The following contest for TNA Explosion is scheduled for one fall. About to make his way to the ring, this is Shadow. The open door policy with the NWA's TNA. Once again, returns to the spotlight with the shadow. The primarily competing for the PCW group down in Dallas, Texas. Let's see how he does in his TNA debut. And his opponent, being led to the ring by Chris Vaughn. He is Heavy D, Tom. Call him Mike? I call him the Equalizer. If you think back, the NWA's director of authority, Eric Watt, has been looking for someone to wear the black shirt, and we see the attack even before the opening bell by Shadow. Eric Watts has been looking for someone that measures up, that can be there to counter, that can be there to neutralize, that can be there to equalize. The TNA Red Shirt Security Group, that's why he recruited Heavy B down here. That's why he is the black shirt equalizer. A little extra help from Chris Vaughn. Good to see Chris Vaughn back. Oh! At least back in the ring. He's got the neck brace off finally. Great to see him as Heavy D just leveled him with a chair. But Mike, we've got to talk about something. Oh, I know what you want to oh, bring up. Oh, baby. Coming up, the rematch. The rematch. AJ Styles, Jeff Jarrett for the NWA World Championship. And I'll tell you what, AJ Styles is true. He belongs. In this division. Boy, you just said a mouthful. Exactly right. Jeff Jarrett, in an effort to avoid 
the rematch that the entire professional wrestling world has been waiting to see. Jeff Jarrett keeps trying to downplay AJ Styles, but he doesn't belong at this level. Well, AJ Styles has proven to the world that he does belong, and he's proven to the NWA that he deserves that return match, and he finally gets it. AJ Styles, Jeff Jarrett, the NWA World's Heavyweight title that's taken. How about Heavy D? Turn in a corner, pillar to post the shadow. No, the little guy out there, Mike. I mean, he's almost the same size and stature as Heavy D. He just doesn't have the experience that Big Don has. And you see the fellow Blackshirt security member, Chris Vaughn, cheering on Heavy D, who now throttles Shadow, hangs in the air, Man. with knees, drives him down to the mat with a choke slam, and all up into the win. The winner of the match, Heavy D. That's why he's the great equalizer. That's why he was recruited by the NWA's director of authority, Eric Watts, to counter the red shirts. And bottom line, how's he doing? Can't do any better than a win. Heavy D, Don Harris, scores the victory. Safe One Security, Music City's most trusted name in home security, is now installing security systems for just $99. Our system protects against break-ins, forced entries, and even medical emergencies 24 hours a day. And even save up to 20% on your homeowner's insurance. If you call within the next 30 minutes, we'll give you this set of key fob remotes absolutely free. When it comes to your family's safety, make your choice a safe one. Call 615-781-1990. 615-781-1990. Safe One Security. Collector's Corner, the one-stop shop for sports fans. You'll find baseball, football, basketball, hockey, and golf cards dating from the early 1900s through today. You'll see your favorite college and pro team merchandise, framed art, autographed cards, memorabilia, collectibles, and supplies. Hi, I'm Kevin Denton, inviting you to our store. Come see us, whether you're buying, selling, or trading. Collector's Corner at 2120 North Gallatin Pike. Call 615-859-3002 or stop in today. How could they have known that a woman this gentle... I adore children. ...could be dangerous. Do you know what a secret is, Emma? ...that a woman this kind could be vicious. Anyone can have an accident. That the woman they took in is out for revenge. What goes around comes around. Mommy! The hand that rocks the cradle. Tonight at 7 on UPN 30. It's the best wrestling on pay-per-view today. TNA Total Nonstop Action Wrestling with Raven, AJ Styles, D'Lo Brown, Jeff Jarrett, and, and the man, man they call Sting. Plus the most extreme, high-flying, death-defying action anywhere with the X Division. There's nothing else like it today. TNA Total Nonstop Action Wrestling only on pay-per-view. Ray, can I ask you a question? Yeah. Why do you pick Sandman over me and Julio when we've been there for you? Why do you pick a trunk? And Eric Watts? Who the hell is Eric Watts to you? Look, I asked both you guys before. I said, let me be. Let me walk my own path. I've tried to set you guys free. I've tried to protect you. But I can not continue to protect you and continue my quest for the NWA World Heavyweight title. I go it alone, I go it by myself. The world I walk in, it's a strange one. It doesn't have friends, and it doesn't have sharing. I think you guys were good to me, but I think I was good to you guys. I think you've grown, and now it's time to spread some wings and leave the nest. Look, I've asked you before, but I'm not telling you again. Welcome back to TNA Explosion, and on behalf of the professor, JB, and all the people involved with Total Nonstop Action, thanks for tuning in, and we hope you had a very happy Thanksgiving. Certainly, Mike, looking ahead to this win tonight, I will be giving thanks, as well as you, I'm sure, and many, many thousands of fans out there, if AJ Styles is able to do it. If AJ Styles is able to dethrone the NWA World Heavyweight Champion, Jeff Jarrett, he's done it once. He did it back in June. Can he do it again? Can history repeat itself? This Wednesday night, we will find out as the epic battle will take place. The NWA World Heavyweight title on the line, Styles versus Jarrett, one-on-one -on -one this Wednesday night. JB, we talked earlier about how every member of the TNA roster 
was a very interested observer in Jarrett versus Styles for the NWA World Heavyweight title. Well, maybe one person more than others, and that's a man who feels that it is his destiny to become NWA World's Heavyweight Champion, and I'm talking about Raven. Think about it. Raven systematically eliminating Father James Mitchell's new church, Sin slash Vampiro, and then Father Mitchell. Now Raven certainly having his problems as of late with the TNA red shirt security, but he vows that once he eliminates the red shirts, he is going to be focused, he is going to concentrate on gaining what he feels is his destiny, the NWA World Heavyweight title, and I think Raven feels like he's going to be in line for a shot at the winner, whether it's Jarrett, whether it's Styles, this Wednesday night. You can bet Raven will be watching and be paying very close attention, as will the entire wrestling world. You can bet Hulk Hogan will be watching this match very closely. Certainly a lot of uh, contenders for that NWA World Heavyweight title. Everybody's gunning for Jeff Jarrett. Well, this one tonight, AJ Styles has kicked, clawed, and scratched his way to the top. This one tonight, Styles will get his rematch against the NWA World Heavyweight Champion, Jeff Jarrett. Julio, I'm sick and tired of being sick and tired. I don't deserve this. You don't deserve this. Both our blood has been spilled. I've been burned for Raven. I was hung from the rafters for Raven. You've sacrificed. I've sacrificed. You've sacrificed more for Raven than he sacrificed for us. That's for damn sure. And now he wants to just walk away. Now, I've been there for him, and you've been there for him. But now he's not there for us. This, this ends. This does not go any further. But this ends. This is definitely going to end. It's the best wrestling on paper. With Raven, AJ Styles, D'Lo Brown, Jeff Jarrett, and the man they call Sting. Plus the most extreme, high-flying, death-defying action anywhere with the X Division. There's nothing else like it today. TNA, Total Nonstop Action Wrestling, only on pay-per-view. Hey, boys. A new mutant arrives. On the next Mutant X. Tonight at 9 on UPN 30. Tonight at 9 on Fox 17 News, you can help catch a criminal. Fox 17 and the Tennessee Bureau of Investigation are teaming up to help capture some of the state's most wanted fugitives. Find out how you can help. Watch Tennessee's Most Wanted. Tonight at 9 on Fox 17 News. Remember when the family would pile in the car and head off on a long drive to get the best catfish anywhere around? Well, that great dining experience still exists, and that special place is the Catfish House. Serving only U.S. farm-raised catfish prepared with all the care and experience our family has gained in 22 years of serving the best catfish around. We now have four locations to serve you, so you don't have to drive quite so far to get great catfish. Clarksville, across the river, Springfield, Smyrna, and Shelbyville. It's the best wrestling on pay-per-view today. TNA, total nonstop action wrestling. With Raven, AJ Styles, D'Lo Brown, Jeff Jarrett, and the man they call Sting. Plus the most extreme, high-flying, death-defying action anywhere with the X Division. There's nothing else like it today. TNA, total nonstop action wrestling, only on pay-per-view. The following contest for TNA Explosion is tag team action. Being led to the ring by the goddess Athena. They are the team of Anne Douglas and Chase Stevens. They are the natural. Well, are you ready for this one? We've seen these two teams compete several times in the past, both on Explosion as well as the TNA pay-per-views. And every time they faced each other, they tore down the house. their opponents. They are the team of Wildcat Chris Harris and Cowboy Jim Storm. They are America's most wanted. Well, Mike, like you said, every time these four get in the ring, they tear down the house. A 
America's Most Wanted needs this victory right here. They are, they are finding themselves being the odd team out when it comes to the tag team department. And it's a belt they've held three times. They need this win. They need to keep the present TNA. They need to get back to the title picture. The quest continues for AMW. The crowd reaction to the asylum for the Tennessee Cowboy James Storm and the Wild Cat Chris Harris. And you see the quest. They even attack the Naturals before the opening bell. That shows you how focused they are on that quest to get those tag belts back. And if I remember right, the last two times these two met, it was the other way around. This time of both put a kick and pin as Chris Harris leads Storm over the rope yeah, on top of the Naturals. And he back body dropped his own tag team partner. Storm up and over the top rope, down to the floor. Took out both Andy Douglas and Chase Stevens. The Wildcat Chris Harris. He's got Stevens up in the ring. We're going to try and bring him into the ring with a suplex. Oh, oh I love this. Yeah, he gets a hold in here for so long. Look at this. What a and great Stevens example of the strength. Look, Look at the strength. It. Look at the power. Toying with it. Oh, wait a minute. He couldn't go ahead and finish the job, though. Quick go behind and then the drop down by Stevens sends Harris out to the floor where Andy Douglas oh, oh, drives him back first into the safety rail. Chris Harris got a little too cocky there. I think he was caught up in the moment. He had him up there. He should have taken him down and slammed him. And that's what can happen for you. Chase Stevens never lost focus. Oh, and you see Athena right there grabbing his... Oh, man. The distraction by Athena leads to a pin attempt by Chase Stevens, but only a two count. They had not weakened... Chris Harris sufficiently to get the pin and the win to the corner. Face first. Chris Harris into the boot of Andy Douglas, who's now tagged in as the legal man. Hey, look, Chris Harris has got to get a tag to James Storm sometime quicker because this team of naturals, I really, I mean, I'm really impressed by this group. They're, they're maybe a little bit smaller than AMW and smaller than most tag teams, but they make up for it in heart. They make up for it in desire. Suplex attempt is blocked by Harris. Douglas tries it again and it's blocked a second time. Look at that. Look at that fire that Douglas got right there. He takes it to Chris Harris right into the head to the knee. How important is it, Don, for America's most wanted not to look past the naturals? And I mean, you can't blame them. It's been now months, well over three months that they've been waiting for their rematch that they never received. They never got a shot at the tag team title belts. That's all they're asking. They want their chance to get those tag title belts back for a fourth time. And I'll tell you what, Mike, I don't even know if they're in that. The rest of the bunch and only all fans. I mean, AMW, like I said, they're finding themselves in a situation where they have got to get back to the top of the mountain if they want to be four-time champs. And you cannot look past the Nationals like you just said earlier. They're too hungry, Mike. The Nationals are just too hungry. Look at this. The left hands by Chris Harris, having momentary oh. effect on Chase Stevens, but then he lays out Harris with the clothesline. Shut up! I think the Naturals are here to prove that they belong in that tag team picture. Well, they belong on the TNA pay-per-views, and a victory here would elevate them into that position. And I think they do. I mean, these guys are fantastic. And he does this, just looks up here at the table, both you and I, Mike, and he's yelling, that's how it's done, that's how it's done. You gotta like that cockiness, you gotta like that fire these guys bring. Wild clothesline, oh. Harris able to duck it, sunset, it. flip a tip, two, no, kick out by Douglas at two. Four to get over this match, ever since the beginning, he's been over the rocks. Smart move by Chase Stevens, whether it's illegal or not. Pulled the hair of Chris Harris, dropped him down to the mat. Now they're gonna cut off the ring. Now they're gonna keep Harris, who's already been weakened, and yes, you mentioned it. Storm, other than that quick flurry in the opening minute of the match, hasn't been in the battle and looking at Athena help out as well. You know what, Mike? It's almost as if if the Naturals are concentrating, they've been concentrating on AMW so much, they know him so well. And they obviously are spending a lot of time in their spare time figuring out how to beat these guys. And they've got the plan. They kept Chris Harris in the ring, they kept Storm out. And the numbers game is, has worked to their advantage. I mean, they've almost pulled this off on a few occasions here, Mike. Backbreaker across the knee by Stevens. Leads to a two count. Now Chase Stevens mounts the top. He's got it. Buckle. Oh, man. Double sledge off the top. Is he going to go for the pin? Can they put AMW away? Now, see, that's, what, that's where he messed up right there. You've got to take the pin. He had, he, he had Harris Fuji. Look at this. Now Douglas going up high. And Douglas... He's in no man's land. You can't give the former champions that kind of leeway, Mike. Only one way to go for Douglas. That's down off the slam off the top. 
Stevens charges across the ring. Takes Storm out of the equation for just a minute, but off the inverted atomic drop, the hot tag is in, and here comes the Tennessee Cowboy. Right hand for both Douglas and Stevens. Now this is where it works to the advantage of AMW. James Storm, oh, and that hit perfectly. James Storm is fresh. James Storm has been waiting to the ring. And Douglas and Stevens have got to be tired. They've got to be spent. Great offensive series. Great offensive assault here by Storm on both members of the Natural. Went for the super kick. It's blocked by Douglas. Oh, that body drops Douglas over the top and down to the floor. As you can see, that Jay Stevens is just doesn't have any balance right now. He has no control. And here they go. They're setting him up for the death sentence. Getting off in a death sentence. Oh, my. Andy Douglas is not going to let it happen. And great reaction by Andy Douglas there, Mike. Pushing Harris off the top rope and sending him, launching him all the way into the safety rail. As you see, Harris try to get up out on the arena floor. And meanwhile, in the ring, Storm and Andy Douglas. And the Tennessee Cowboy to the top, but... Chase Stevens cuts him off from behind. Now the Naturals are going to try and double team. Oh, he's got him. Off the power bomb. Ten, two. He got the shoulder up at two. I'll tell you what happened there. You could have stopped Douglas' face when he hit the man. And also, that's what high risk is. It cost him. And he just didn't have the strength to hold him down. Harris up on top. This is how they beat him the last time. He hit the hard body. Two. No. AMW beat the Naturals last time. Harris hitting that top rope cross body block, but this time, Chief Stevens able to miraculously kick out a two. Mike, you said it was going to tear the house down, and you're right. These guys put on the best explosive matches we've seen in tag team action. Look at him. You think this is for the title? Oh! Did you see that? Harris caught him in midair. Speared him in midair. Off the top rope. Uh oh. Steel chair in the ring. Chase Stevens has it. Athena's got Athena has got it. Uh, distracted, but it worked in their favor. Cut the kick. Here's the pin. Here's two. Here's he three. Got it and AMW did it. The winners of the match, Americans. Most wanted. Oh, they're back. And they're back in line for a tag title shot. How much longer can this team be denied? The most dominant tag team. In the history of TNA, the three-time NWA World Tag Team Champion, looking for that fourth ring. The quest continues for Chris Harris and James Storm, and they will not be denied until they become Tag Team Champions again. Jeff Jarrett claims that AJ Styles can't compete on his level, but AJ Styles has held every single belt in TNA, and this week he gets a chance to reclaim the NWA heavyweight title belt. That's right, the rematch. AJ Styles, Jeff Jarrett, for the NWA heavyweight title. Will AJ Styles have enough to get it back, or will Jeff Jarrett retain? You've got to be there. It is going to be a match that will be off the charts. AJ Styles, Jeff Jarrett, NWA World Heavyweight Championship. We're standing in the Hall of the Asylum, where current and former NWA World Heavyweight Champions pictures hang. AJ Styles... In a little over five weeks, you've got your rematch. It took me four months to get my rematch when you defeated me. But you know what it's all about right now. Gang warfare. It's me, Jeff Jarrett, against the entire world. Jimmy Hart brought in Dougie. He brought in the dog-faced Grumman, Rick Steiner. He brought in Sting. Raven shooting for me. AJ, you know how it is. The entire world is shooting for you when you hold this belt. But there's an extra added ingredient in this that makes it all different. Makes, makes the cards fall quite differently. And that's Hulk Hogan. The biggest icon this sport has ever seen. So AJ, Wednesday night, TNA pay-per-view. It's me against you. You bring whatever bag of tricks you want to bring. I'm walking in the champion and I'm walking out the champion. You get that? I guarantee you one thing. Callus is going to see to it that Watts can't interfere. And my red shirts, they're going to see to it that Raven can't interfere. And Abyss, <laughs> he's my trump card. So, AJ, get ready, because this is your one and only chance. See you Wednesday, kid. I'm a survivor. That's what I do. That's how you play this game. 
I survived against the abyss, Jeff. You tried to water me down. It didn't happen. Fact of the matter is, you didn't want to have this match anyway. That's okay. You don't have anything to worry about. Why? Because I'm not in your league. There'll be no competition for you. So why worry about it? Believe me, I'm coming. And after I leave, you'll know why they call me phenomenal. Because I'm leaving with my title. World title. Hi, Christian Calvin here for Option Rentals. Option Rentals is celebrating its 23rd year of serving Nashville with fine quality furniture, appliances, and electronics. Tired of that worn out sofa? Option Rentals has seven piece living room groups starting as low as just $25 per week and over 100 to choose from. Looking to upgrade that TV? Option Rentals has a full lineup of high definition flat screen TVs, so don't delay. Or watch goes, it's gonna come down to this. I told you guys that it was us against the world. It's Jeff Jarrett against the world. Well, I'm gonna take Dusty Rhodes out. I'm gonna take each and every one of those fans out. You guys, I don't wanna see Raven walking next week. You hear me? I wanna see him walking. You make sure you go tell him this. He didn't get the job done on AJ Styles, and I want it rectified now. I don't wanna face him in two weeks. That's right. This way. Dusty Rhodes, the American dream. I never thought it would come to this, ever. But now it's me and you, one-on-one -on -one dream. I'm going to prove exactly what I said a few weeks ago, that you are not a worthy contender. And the Asylum fans, show up. I got something for each and every one of you. Jimmy Hart, bring them all. Matter of fact, let Hulk Hogan be around ringside with a belt. I'm praying that you walk down the ring, Hogan. I'm praying. Big Callis. Everything's good. I told them they got to get... You know what? Make no mistake about it, Jeff Jarrett. We talked about old school for a long time. You made your bed, now you gotta lie in it. You better lie there with one eye open. Because in the asylum, we gonna bring it all together next week. The fans gonna have straps. Ten fans are gonna have straps. And when you go outside, they gonna whip you like a dog. That's the road the American dream. It ain't about titles. It ain't about me being uh, on par with you, as you say. Let me tell you something. A reckoning's coming, and it's coming Wednesday night in the asylum, in this strap match. You're going to feel some pain, blues, and agony. Fans revenge. I'm liking it. You know, Jeff, the more and more I think about my belt and you, I realize that you have no respect. Zero. But the good thing about that is you'll be wrestling Dusty Rhodes. And he's going to beat respect into you. And after he's done beating respect into you, I'm going to beat humility into you. You don't want to miss this Wednesday night. There's going to be so much action here at TNA. We've got X versus Chris Saban. We've got the X Division title on the line with Michael Shane and the newcomer Song J. Dutz. We also had the tag title belts on the line again. Three live crew against Simon Swinger. And then Dusty Rhodes, he made the match. It's a TNA fan revenge match. That's right, ten fans surround the ring with leather straps. Dusty Rhodes against Jeff Jarrett. Don't miss it this week. TNA fan revenge match. Dusty Rhodes, Jarrett, you gotta be there. See Georgia take on Kentucky today at